and Steve Kerr. This is not pressure, this is fun. Pressure was last summer when I was looking for a job. You know? That's right. So the, last year he was forgotten in Orlando. This year he could play a very important role if the Bulls are to make it four straight. I got together with Steve after a recent practice and we talked trays. Defense in the playoffs becomes so much more prominent and teams are really trying to clog the lane and, and as a result there are more open shots on the outside. So you do need people who can shoot from the perimeter. If I catch it here and now I bend my knees and get my feet set, then I'm going to be out of rhythm because the defense is going to be right. on me and I'll have to do all kinds of setting up. Whereas if I get everything set and I catch, I can go right up with it and I'm ready. So awesome. the, the preparation is really, before you even get the ball, is where it all starts. I, pro I shoot probably two to three hundred shots a day in the off season. Really? But I, like I said, I, I generally practice from about right here. To be a good three-point shooter, first of all, you have to be a really good shooter, period. Yeah. And I practice from 15 to 17 feet. This is the toughest. Toughest one right Yeah, now. I think so, because you got, the line is a little different. You know, all of a sudden you get, you get a point here. It's not a straight line. So, you, you know, if your feet are like that, you may be squared perfectly to the basket, but your foot might yeah. be on the line. So, to me, this is the toughest three-point shot. I'll see if they can make it. Oh, I know okay. you can. Gee, thanks. Why did I ask? <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Now see, you, you have to have a good passer too. <laughs> you know, if you have a bad passer on your team, forget it. If you go out there tense and you feel stressed out and you feel, you know, if you're worried about missing the shot or something, then the three-point shot is going to be a, a very difficult one. You don't need to be a jumper, but you do need strong legs. You don't need 20-20 vision, but you better know where your feet are. And you don't need to be a superstar, but a three-point shot at the right time will make you a hero. And it just might make your team a champion.